exactly 40 years ago when I answered an ad in the newspaper and went to work for her doing business development for the commercial interiors firm that she was running. And the rest is history. She ended up becoming godmother to my middle son and one of my very dearest friends. And how about Tom? I met Tom through Jody, and there was an instant affinity there as well. I was on the founding board, which means I was one of those folks in the back room of Eaton Park, having breakfast and listening to Tom and Jody's vision. And I believed in Tom and Jody, so I believed in the vision. And um, how did you assist or get involved with the school? All kinds of ways. I was there on opening day in Champion Commons. And as you may have been told, opening day was something we wondered about whether we should do the day after 9-11. And the decision was made to have good fly in the face of evil. So with uh, great respect for what had happened the day before, we went ahead and opened. And I remember uh, working at some point early on with a CMU design studio to develop the logo that is still in use today. I remember our gathering early on for a visioning session at uh, Calvary Episcopal Church. And we were just trying to dream big. And I asked the question, what headlines would you like to see about the school 20 years from now, where we are now? Uh, some people talked about having its own facility. I don't think they probably ever envisioned anything this wonderful. My answer was, headline, Neighborhood Academy closes its doors because the Pittsburgh Public Schools have adopted the model. I remember working with Frank McNutt on constructing a set of drapes that must have been for use in the stage in the church across the street maybe and we were crawling around on the floor with these long bolts of black cloth and stitching these things together. Um, I also will always fondly remember the history conference where I got to serve as a judge and that was always so interesting and so much fun and made me so proud of the kids because they did so well vis-a-vis -vis their peers at other schools. Happy 21st anniversary, Neighborhood Academy.